Hey everyone, welcome back. And in today's video, I'll be showing you how to optimize your computer speed with a reliable antivirus. Now, there has been an age old debate about whether or not antiviruses themselves would slow down your PC. And if you asked me about this six to seven years ago, I would quite agree with the statement. However, most modern antiviruses won't slow your systems down as they generally use less of your CPU. And so if you're experiencing a drop in performance, it could generally be one of two things. Either you're using an outdated antivirus or your PC is being slowed down by external factors and not the antivirus. So in this video, I'll be going over these external factors and how they affect your system's performance. I'll also be showing you how to use an antivirus to deal with these factors using my personal favorite antivirus, Norton. Now, what I'm about to show you isn't exclusive to Norton and other top antiviruses have such system optimization tools. So if you'd like to see a few more options, I'll be leaving some in-depth reviews as well as discounts in the description down below. Okay, so the first factor that might be slowing down your PC are the apps running in the background. Now, you don't have to necessarily start these apps yourself for them to launch, since a lot of software nowadays launches on startup. A few examples of this would be apps such as Spotify, Steam, game launchers, browsers, and more. So how do you exactly fix this? Well, you could go to each app and turn off their launch on startup settings, but that would take ages, especially if you don't know which apps are starting up and running in the background. This is where Norton Startup Manager comes in handy. All you need to do here is launch the Norton 360 app, click on open right next to device security, click on performance and press on startup manager. This would open up a menu of programs that have the ability to launch on startup. From there, you can see how much resource each app is using, turn these apps on and off and even delay their startup which is really convenient. As for the second factor that could be slowing your system down, that would be having your hard drive almost full. If there is not enough space on the disk, the disk is fragmented, or it has too many junk files, it will slow down the system. Similarly, old hard drives can also reduce functionality, resulting in speed problems. Here, you can use Norton's file cleanup feature to help clean your storage. And the way this feature works is by removing unwanted files from Windows temporary folders. Over time, temporary files can significantly reduce the available disk storage space on your computer and affect performance. And so file cleanup automatically removes a temporary and unused files from your computer. And if you want to run this cleanup process manually, you have the option to do that as well. Simply click on open right next to device security, click on performance and choose file cleanup. Another factor that would slow down your PC would be outdated software, especially the operating system. Most of the time programs would drop updates where they tweak their system optimization in order for their apps to run smoothly. However, almost everyone ignores these updates because it's too much hassle to go around and check which programs need to be updated. Norn has a tool for that as well. Simply open up the software updater right from the home screen and it will run a scan on all your programs and inform you which ones need updating. Basically, you can update these programs in one go, which is pretty convenient. You can also turn on auto updates which would update these apps in the background without your direct permission. Though I wouldn't recommend turning it on if you have slow internet speed since you'll notice a drop whenever it updates something. As for the last and most obvious factor that would slow down your PC, we have malware. Malware, viruses, spyware, and adware are the number one cause of computer slowdown. The malware can still slip through even if you think you are very cautious when downloading a file or working online. And I would highly recommend steering clear of free antivirus programs to deal with this mess, since most of them come jam-packed with spyware and adware themselves. Instead, look for reputable paid products that have perfect malware detection rates on test sites such as AV Test. I personally use Norton 360, as you can see, since it has perfect malware detection rates and has been an industry favorite for ages. But if you want me to name a few others, I would recommend Total AV, McAfee, and Bitdefender. So to sum it up, most of the factors that are slowing down your PC are external, 
and having a reputable antivirus with great system optimization tools can greatly help in speeding up your PC. And so if you're looking for an antivirus with such features and don't know where to start, I'll be leaving some in-depth reviews on antiviruses that I personally recommend in the description down below, along with some discounts. So make sure to check that out. And that's it for today's video. If you liked the content or found it useful, make sure to like the video and subscribe to see more of it. And if you have any questions or suggestions, don't hesitate to leave them in the comments as I love interacting with you guys. And that will be all for today and I'll see you in the next one.